Thanks for staying tuned to STL TV Live. I'm Sarah Thompson, and I'm still joined by Gina Galati to talk more about Winter Opera St. Louis and its eighth season, which starts starts this weekend, technically. Yes, yes it sure does. So we left off at The Wise Women, which is Correct. your sort of holiday production. Yes. Um, but we continue on into 2015. Yes, and we have L'Amico Fritz by Pietro Mascagni. It's the first time it's uh, been done here in St. Louis, so we're doing the premiere of it. It's it's a very famous opera. It's not done very often. Okay. More, It's done more in, in Europe uh, than here, but it's a small cast. We have a great tenor, Jorge Pita Carreras, coming in to sing that opera. He's, he used to cover for Placido Domingo, really? I mean for Pavarotti, mm -hmm. and uh, he sung with Renee Fleming and lots of different people, and it's an amazing instrument voice, and it's a lovely story uh, about uh, uh, a man who vows he'll never get married, then of course he, uh, <laughs> his, uh, his, the, the rabbi says, well I bet, I'll bet you these vineyards you know, they're in Italy, these wonderful vineyards that someday you will get married, and sure enough he fixes some fixes uh -huh. him up with someone in a way uh, and he falls madly in love and and it's it's a very simple story but it's beautiful music and we're really excited to be the first ones in St. Louis to put it on. So. And that's in Italian so yes, it's it sung is. completely in Italian. Correct. Well, we always have super titles mm -hmm. uh, so you everyone will understand. Okay. Um, okay. Now that's it's always so interesting to me with opera. I love that the how the humor is injected yes. into the stories. I mean, sometimes you can get very serious works and right. serious pieces, and then other times it's just the premise or how yes. it's humorous. It's so interesting how it's worked in. How does that? How is that in this case reflected in the music and you know, in the lyrics? It's it's a it's just a very lyrical. Uh, Opera, but what's funny is, you know, it, it does have this this Jewish family in Italy that is uh -huh. that is uh, that, that's this man who's very wealthy, and uh, you know he he's he kind of acts like a bachelor, and he doesn't want to ever he's married, afraid yeah. of marriage, <laughs> and then of course he can't live without this woman mm -hmm. after he meets her. So uh, it's just a it's it's a comedy in itself because of. It's it's relative to yeah. people that you know nowadays. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> so, and then what? Cl which production closes the season? Our biggest production, Otello. We've uh, by Giuseppe Verdi. We're uh, we're really excited to put on an, uh, this Otello. Uh, we have Washington University Choir that will be singing with our production, and uh, we have some great singers coming in from all over to to sing. It's going to be the big the big kahuna for the for the year. <laughs> That's no. And I mean, yes. with Otello and Othello, which people are, yes. is it pretty much like the same or what? Or what what's very the difference in terms story. of the story? D very, very similar very, story. Okay. Um, you know, it just, it's just put with music. It's just put with music. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yes, yeah. Exactly. And so this is the big production. Who's going to be participating in this one? Uh, well, Steve Jarvie, our music director, will be conducting. Uh, we have uh, Mark Fryman as our director. Uh, he's directed for us. Uh, in the past before and uh, you know it's a lot of new artists this season that we're bringing in we did our auditions in New York again and um, and our of course in St. Louis and uh, we picked a lot of people from New York but we also picked a lot of people that came to St. Louis to audition for us so it's it's going to be a good season I feel very very happy about what's what's to come so feel very fortunate and for people who don't know in addition to being the general director yes. of Winter Opera <laughs> you are also a singer an I opera am. singer so I, I have to ask you which production you're sure. participating in this year um, I'm participating in the Lomico Fritz this year okay yeah who, who will you be singing which character um, I'm singing Suzelle and okay. she's the girl that the, the tenor falls in love with uh, the peasant girl. So I get to play a peasant girl this year. The peasant girl for the yes. season. It'll be memorable. Yes. It'll be memorable. Exactly. It sounds fun, though. Yes. No, but this is great. Well, good luck with your season. Thank you very much. It sounds much. so much fun. We've got the information there for you. It's the 2014 15 season of Winter Opera St. Louis. Uh, technically, it starts in October with um, some residency artist performances. Uh, this weekend, actually, at local universities, so you can go to the website to learn more about that. And then the season really does kick off in November with The Marriage of Figaro, followed by the ones that you see on the screen, and it closes out in March with Otello, which is a big, big production with a lot of musicians, a lot of singers flying into St. Louis, and locally, as you said, yes. to participate. So check it out. You've got to at least see one this season, so head to <laughs> Winter Opera STL. Dot org. And thank you again thank for being you. here. I look forward to next season, but yes. you got to get through this one. So <laughs> okay. good luck with everything. Thank now. you very much. All right. Thank you. Well, we're not done yet. There's more STL TV Live coming your way. We'll be right back right after this.